Good afternoon, children. Welcome back to the online class. Today's memory verse is Do not fear, for I am with you. Isaiah 43 5. Do not fear, for I am with you. God is telling us, Do not fear, because He is with us. Okay, now let's go into the class Mathematics. The last lesson, that is the fifth lesson, Information Processing. The before class, we have already discussed about making a map of known areas. Making a map of known areas, that is modeling. Map making. So, this lesson will be full of maps like this. And we have discussed here nothing but house is there here. And here one garden is there. Here one pond and then river. So, now we have to tell that. See here garden. Where is the garden? Left side. To the left side of the house. Now what about the house? To the right side of the garden. What about the pond? Pond is left side to the river. What about the river? River is right side to the pond. Simple. So simple. This is what we are going to learn. Now the next thing what we are going is. Like I have said you to, the, to do this assignment in the last class. See here. Here she is Divya. She wants to go to library. Library is here. Okay. So already they have given one green line. The way to library. Now what happened is they have asked us few questions. Okay. First question is name the location. She passed in the given route so this is the route she went and what whatever she met in that route see here she met a bank and a fire station and finally post office while going to library so bank fire station and post office okay now the second question from the library, Divya needs to reach pharmacy. Trace the path and name the landmarks between library and pharmacy. From here to pharmacy, she has to go. That is why she is going like this. Okay. Now trace the path means see what is there in between. Park is there, market is there and hospital is there in between library and pharmacy. Trace another route for Divya's house to library. From Divya's house to library, already they have given one route. Now, another route we have to trace. So, this is the route she can go. This blue color. Okay. Next. Mention any two places between museum and park. Between museum and park. Museum and park. Park is here and museum is here. We have to mention any two places. So, I have mentioned here pharmacy and market. You can tell uh, hospital and market also. Otherwise, hospital and pharmacy also. Okay, that's it. Very easy. Now, see the second one. They have given one route. That is the bus route. From here, this is the bus stand. Okay. Now, how many ways... Okay, this bus can reach to this bus stand. Okay, so first one they have already given A, A to B, B to C, C to I, I to L and L to E. Finally, it will go like this. Now, we have to write the second one. So, N from N to B, B to A, A to D and it will go like this. Otherwise, N G, J, F, K, E like this. Now, write the shortest route. What is the shortest route? See here, from A, A to D and it will go directly. This is the shortest route, A to D. Longest route from N, N to G, G to H, H to M and finally it has to go like this. This is the longest route. Okay. Like this they will ask the questions. The next part of this lesson is finding a quick way of finding 10 more than and less than 
the given number. This is nothing but they have given one table of form and in that we have to color like this. Color the number starting from 12 in blue. Color the number starting from pink in pink. I mean in 6 in pink. Color the number starting from 5 in yellow. Color the numbers starting from 9 in orange. Okay. So this is the way you have to color. Now after coloring we will observe. After coloring we will observe the table and like we have to fill the blanks like this. 10 more than 45 is. After 45 what will come? 55. 45 plus 10. 55. 10 less than 45. Less than means here nothing but instead of 4. Instead of 4 we have to cut this and keep 3. Here more than means instead of after after 4, 5. The same thing 55 like this. 35. Now 10 more than 22. So cut more means plus 1. Less means minus 1. So here 12 like this. Okay. This is the way you can write. Okay. Now this is the last part. See here 21, 21, 23, 25, 27, 29. These are all numbers they give. This plus 10. For these all numbers we have to add 10. So 21 plus 10 how much? 31 plus 1. For the tens number we have to add plus 1. 23 plus 10, 33. 25 plus 10, 35. 27 plus 10, 37. 29 plus 10, 39. And what about minus 10? Minus 10 is nothing but we have to minus this tens number. Minus 1, this tens number. 21 minus 10, 11. 23 minus 10, 13. 25 minus 10, 15. 27 minus 10, 17. 29 minus 10, 19. This is the way we can find out. Easily plus 10 and minus 10. Okay children with this we have finished mathematics all the units for the second term. Okay please read well for your exam. Second term exam. Okay children I hope you all understood all the lessons. Thank you.